Ashley, though, we have so many crews scattered around the country right now for this phenomenon. Tell us where we've got people at. You bet we do. Here's the view. Kumasi is in Oregon, one of the first places to experience the eclipse. Our Amy Taylor, this is cool, took a flight during the eclipse from Denver to Nashville to give us that bird's eye view of the event. Our Lauren Rosella followed a crew from the St. Pete Astronomy Club to North Carolina. But first, our Nicole Grigg is set up with people here in Tampa that went over to Mosi to watch. Nicole? Ashley, I can't believe right now that we can still see this solar eclipse. It looks so cool right now. Uh, it's almost done, though, but here at Mosey, let me tell you, it was insane out here. The traffic, the people are gone now, just wrapping up. One guy told me he's been here since 8 o'clock this morning, waiting in line just to see all this happen. And the best part out here was there were so many kids that got to see science up close. That is amazing. Like, I got, do you see it? It was so hard to buy those eclipse glasses. People stood in line for more than an hour at Mosey just to get a chance to look through them. That's so cool. Please do not look directly at the sun yet. The they let groups of 80 people at a time come into this blocked off area to give them a try. We were waiting online. The line is like really long just to get glasses to see it. And just on the other side, people stood in line for a closer view through a telescope. I just wanted him to witness something that hasn't happened in a really long time. One thing we saw everywhere, kids, parents taking their children out early just to see this. So like to be alive at this moment and see it is kind of cool. Oh, I see it. And I wanted to experience it together. Mosey estimates at least 3,000 people. They tell us they were not expecting these crowds that backed up traffic for miles just to find parking. I would, I would thank my mom so much. I would like, thank you, thank you. Like, I'm very happy she took us because we just came from school. One thing's for sure, everyone says it was worth every second they waited. Yes, now? And guys, really quick, I was just going to show you right here. You can see there's a few kids left right now. They're kind of trickling out of here, but you can see they have their own boxes. They, they got to make those here. So we'll send it back to you guys in the studio. Reporting live, Nicole Gregg for the Now Tampa Bay.